bacteria going in. But sometimes it sinks. Could you just tell us what the deal is with this? This is, uh, no, I don't really want to do that again. Tell me. It's a, it's a scoby. She just went through it, the Scotty in detail. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, but I can't repeat it because I don't know. I, no. We're making, I'm making, we're listening. making, we're making, <laughs> I'm making kombucha. I don't even know if those are all right. What are you making? Kombucha? Kombucha? The scoby here it looks like a big gross mushroom. Uh, what's a scoby? You have to That's, tell us This what is the mushroom is. thing. It's the big scoby thing. The scoby thing. Or what does the scoby thing do? It's called a symbiotic colony something yeast organism. So that the, the scoby's Yeah. An it's the mushroom and it eats the caffeine and the tea and the sugar. That's what you put in here. And then it turns it into like this fizzy probiotic. Mm. So then, this is only the second time I've done it, we get the, this, this we're going to take the scoby and strain all the crap out of it, out, and then put the bottle it with some different flavors in, in those bottles that are airtight. Rhubarb, and then ras rhubarb, and then ginger in that one. I don't know. The berries one we've done before are good, but I haven't tried those ones yet. Oh yeah, and I'm going to try to divide the scoby because your mom wants some. And apparently you can split it off, so um, I guess you just pick it up, and it looks really gross. And this one has air bubbles in it. I don't know what the hell that's all about. Okay, so that's going to be for your mum. So you put it in there with some starter so it stays alive. This is going to stay as our one. Always clumps of gross stuff. Apparently that's just yeast colonies, or yeast whatever you call it. I don't know what the word is. Stuff. Yeast stuff. You can't get, you have to use metal only when you're not going to be using the scoby anymore because apparently the metal is toxic to the scoby. Okay, and then we're just going to strain it out on the bench. Okay, apparently, and then you want to keep an, an inch, a little bit more than that, at the top. An inch of air. An inch of air space at the top. Yeah. That's three inches. Well, it's, I can't fill it up anymore because it's so foamy. Okay, and then we'll do it again. And that's it. And then we'll fill, fill the bottles up. Now, when, and then you want to, I didn't do it yet because i got to leave the house, but you want to brew your tea with sugar for the next batch. You should I should have done that earlier. And then you put your scoby in it, and you need two cups of a starter tea that you had in here because that balances the pH of the new batch so that bacteria can't grow. And it tastes so good and it's so good for you and the kids love it. Like they think that they're having a treat when they drink it. Suckers. Suckers. That's health food.